Um, uh, what of this, uh, first tell us about your costume and what did you make and, um, yeah. And we need to keep, I'm sorry, we need to keep these about 30 seconds. Okay, 30 seconds. I'm um, a, I know, wise one, and um, I kind of like went to the store and bought stuff, because I'm cheap. <laughs> <laughs> and, but I did modify all this, I put the laces and the drawstring in that, but, uh, Right there, you can just give us a full look at the costume, a full, a nice small twirl, right there, a little bit back so we can see the whole thing. Walk around. Very nice. Okay, okay, we got it all. All right. Um, right there, just so we can hold this chair to block it. A few steps back. Right there, perfect. <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, I'm an Isola at the Green and well, I made this last year to get this right on all this. And this one I actually found it in a store. I thought it looked neat. Very cool. <laughs> Thank you, that's very nice. That's cool that you made that. I just actually, I had it. He shipped it to he shipped it to the hotel. It got here yesterday. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I was like nail biting the whole time. Are you wearing contacts? Yeah, oh yeah, and the contacts too. Right? The oh, yeah. And the beard. Yeah. Wow. How much did you charge for that? Uh, I think it would, uh, came, with the shipping, it comes out to like five hundred. But I'm not paying for all the shipping because if he was supplied, I mean, I gave it to him like two over two months ago, and he didn't start making it until Sunday. Okay. And he finished it, so he had a second day air, a 65 pound, four foot size okay, steel. Yeah. So it was like 200 bucks okay. to ship it, but I'm not paying for the whole shipping. He said he, would, he said he would eat the difference of like just regular shipping if he had shipped it like two okay. weeks ago. But then we have to ship it home. Yeah, but now I have to ship it home. <laughs> no, certainly not. Wow. New York. That's incredible. Uh, Thank you very much. Uh, Long Island. It was really impressive. Yeah, Thank you. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I, uh, I designed the dress and then I helped to um, make the pattern for me. And then my boyfriend made the belt. Uh, Sweet. So can you go ahead and put the back of the belt?
<laughs> I have, you didn't expect this I one, did you? <laughs> and I've got a speech ready to go. It's okay. going to be grand. Not for wow. here, for in there. Wow. <laughs> Gray, where's Waldo? <laughs> I mean, seriously, you can't ever find me. I just yeah. blend right in. Yeah. <laughs> You're a perfect person. <laughs> <laughs> oh. awesome. I made the hats. Did you? It was a trade for the belt. Is he uh, the person who made the belt? I am. Yes. Another you are a weird couple. <laughs> Wait, you bought elf ears from me last year. <laughs> it works. Uh, I'm Karen Braden. Um, my friend Pinky made the top for me, and my friend Derek made the Power Vault Forged Warhammer for me. And this is my lovely friend Eagle, who's in the company. And so I have to obey her and basically get whipped in my hair. So. <laughs> you doesn't have anybody in a cage back there. No, the cage on your back there. Oh. Yes. Is that where you put Perrin when you, you, you know, disobey her? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Pounds? No, I'm but it's on fire. Yeah, so <laughs> that's pretty cool. It's rot with the power of okay, yes. That's really cool. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've learned at moment multiple times not to wear 60 pounds worth of stuff, <laughs> especially in Atlanta in the summertime. So not carrying around it, yeah, it's just home. So. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Was that Fire, Fire's dress there? Did, did you make that? Or? Her mother made it, yeah. Oh, wow. That's great. Yeah. Alana's writing dress, the gray slash green. Oh. Now, I didn't want to make those. Pinky Shears did. I did help. I did a lot of the patchwork and the hand stitching on the sleeves. Bells. Oh, yeah, I like the design of the, the layers. Well, that would be the slashing that Mr. Jordan was describing. The slashing is usually found just in the sleeves of work. No, no, no. Yes. Goblet. <laughs> Thank you. So, but he described it in skirts and pants as well. So we decided to incorporate that. Well, I, nice. I just wear it. <laughs> Made by me, sewn, except for the boots and my belt. Did the boots come with the fur? No, I added all the fur. All the wood crap fur. Not wool. <laughs> no. What's on your? Is that a knife in your belt? I've got a belt knife, and my skirts are divided. Mm -hmm. um, I was going to make them, but I ended up finding them online, so I figured that would probably look a little better. So, yes. 
Thank you. Great. Thank you. I'm fine with doing a little less traffic. Um, the pants are the same pants from my Oshman outfit. Uh, the chainmail is borrowed. Uh, Walter can sort of also borrowed from the Mason Mace because uh, they carry a lot of equipment. Um, Missy painted the eye patch. Sarah, if you saw, did the makeup for the bald cap. Uh, made the little leather thing on the top uh, to hide the seams and stuff for the hair. And I did the collodion, so, which is all the scarring. Are you really using an eye? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we can make, we can make, make that happen. Show <laughs> Thank you. I can see going this way. <laughs> Oh, there he is. <laughs> 
iPads that are coming up. Uh, <laughs> 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 I was going for Moraine in the warmth and less the beginning of the Dragon Reborn uh, as she first appears in this field. This was my interpretation of the slashes, but um, I was uh, throwing myself upon my mother's mercy about a month ago to sew this for me because I'm totally inept. But she did uh, as a birthday present for me, and I designed um, the style of the dress. And she let me even sew on a couple of these things before taking them out and pretending that she left them. <laughs> but, um, let's see, um, the only things that I bought were the, um, the ring here, which I actually, I don't really like the officially licensed versions of the ring in this. So I, I made this, um, and then this ring was the silver version, because I did not want to spend $600 on gold version. <laughs> uh, so I painted it multiple times until I got something vaguely resembling gold. Uh, and then I bought the ballet slippers and the little things too. I love the cloak. I can't see the shoes. I'm sorry. That's okay. They're leather. Oh, move back there. Oh, okay. Okay. I looked at some medieval term shoes, but there was only one type that was in a color that would look like something. So I just picked up these. Did you, and your the hair? Did you do your hair? You no, know, actually, I missed this morning's events because even though I had an appointment to have a salon put it up, they left me in there. Yeah. It's apparently I picked prom day uh, to, to go and you'd be amazed how many people asked me if I was going to prom and I'm 30 years old. So. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's, nice. Yeah. that's good. Yeah. Yeah. That just means you look 18. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> through the legs to keep the round shape. <laughs> Kept like some extra wire laying around the house. And uh, a whole lot of uh, fake leaves. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say there's probably about $400 worth of fake leaves in this. <laughs> it's amazing how much this stuff costs. I love the flowers up, up the very yeah. crowded. <laughs> the blue flowers. The yeah. Now, is it wrong if I ask you to look? Okay. I, can, I can rotate, yes. Uh, now, know, one thing I did yeah. to the costume this year that was a mistake was I decided to go with Velcro for attaching the legs. And so it's constantly coming loose. It was a bad idea. Just have it twice. That's why I have an awesome uh, gardener who's pretty <laughs> uh, Not many people know that all green men get one of those. <laughs> and I can rotate. Did you make the stilts? The stilts I did not make. The stilts are drywaller stilts. However, I figured out how to use them properly this year so I don't feel like I'm dying while standing on them. <laughs> so yes, this, this costume is still really hot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Any further questions? Are they from Paris to Caribou? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Aside from moonlighting as the uh, gardener, <laughs> I'm your uh, garden variety uh, Ashaman. Garden variety. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, I like the sword. Yeah. Look yeah. at that sword. It's, 
sword I borrowed from a friend of mine. Uh, I, I, I like it a lot because it's got the it's got the Chinese dragons all over it. Are you able to pull that out a little bit? Uh, I would, except I'm peace bound. Oh, okay. yeah. Although the Mahal says I have no need of one, so that's no problem. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I pretty much bought everything. Uh, yeah, both yeah. Yeah, the gold pin is still <laughs> ludicrously expensive, but uh, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hi. I'm the queen. Uh, I bought my dress in my dream ring. Cool. I actually just found this plastic ring. Because I bought a scarf. The scarf came with a ring. Oh, and that's perfect. Yeah, that's great. Right. That's really good. I'd like the judges to go ahead and move over to the main room. So thank you very much.